useless internet hippies? Hi everyone, it's me, Dee Dee. Well, my daughter Dee Dee spent Christmas serving at the homeless shelter. She made me come along too. Said I had to learn my lesson for trying to ruin Thanksgiving for all those freeloading relatives of ours. I hope Christmas was as pure and meaningful for all of you as it was for me and Dad. You know, I feel like a changed woman, and I know it really made a difference in Dad as well. Well, I went along all right, and I did my part to help those poor folks. But I did not learn anything except how to bathe without any water, and how to make a rat cannon out of common everyday items you can find in any dumpster. Dee Dee can't go for long without having some sort of shindig. Next time she tries it, this little fella is gonna make quite a splash. <laughs> and I've decided I'm gonna teach all you webnet peeping toms how to make one too. You're welcome. First of all, you'll need some sort of tube and of course some rats. Living or dead. Slide it down the barrel and let him fly. <laughs> now, quit sitting there on your desk and go build your own. I got better things to do than to talk to you all day. Right now, I'm gonna go do some target practice out behind the wood pile. Hi everyone. So, I have a secret. After spending a quiet and introspective Christmas, I'm going all out for New Year's. Mm -hmm. My party planning instinct is in overdrive. I've made three, one, two, three, lists to make sure everything goes according to plan. See, one, two, three. Mm -hmm. And the first item on each of these lists is the same. Hold on, see if you can see them, okay? Can you see that? It says, don't let dad find out. Good news, social media bums. <laughs> social media. Anyway, I got good news. I just found out Dee Dee is throwing a party on New Year's Day. <laughs> that means we'll get to see the rat cannon in action even sooner than we thought. <laughs> now, I made some, some, some to-do to lists so I won't forget anything. Item number one, I, item number one, get more rats. Ah, pro tip. You always need more rats than you think. I wonder how much cheese we have in the refrigerator. Hi everyone, it's me, Dee Dee. <laughs> Well, we're a day closer to my New Year's party and everything is going according to plan. This morning, I plugged in the old crock pot and by now, hmm, my world famous potato chowder should be ready. As I was making a couple of sandwiches to go with the potato chowder, 
I went to the refrigerator and noticed there wasn't a sliver, a sliver of cheese in that refrigerator. I know I bought a block of Swiss the other day. I know I did. And this feels <laughs> weirdly familiar. You don't think he... Nah, he couldn't have possibly found out. Day has been so busy sneaking around all week. She hasn't noticed me sneaking around all week. I have rodent traps scattered strategically throughout half the neighborhood. The hardest part is finding places to store the ammo while we wait for D-Day. But don't worry, I got hiding places Dady wouldn't find in a decade of looking. <laughs> It'll be a New Year's they'll never forget. Oh, oh, I lost my rat. Here and, oh, don't you fall off again. <laughs> Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Hi, sweetie. You stay in there, okay? Okay, turn this thing off. So, I've been thinking, do you remember how worried Dad was on Thanksgiving that we were going to run out of money and food and end up on the street gnawing on tree bark to survive? Well, even though he acted like a crazy person, I still don't want him to be upset. So instead of cooking all the food for the New Year's party myself or hiring a caterer, Everyone is bringing something, kind of like potluck, but, but not potluck. I spent all afternoon on the phone working out the menu. Mm -hmm. We'll have the perfect cross-section of dishes and delicacies without straining anyone's budget. Only three days left. Two days to go to the Rat Cannon's public debut. Closer we get to New Year's, the harder it's been to keep things hidden from Dad. But so far, I don't think he suspects anything. And you're probably asking yourself, what is the best way to store the rats for my Rat Cannon? He's been spending a lot of time out in that old work shed. I recommend the Paw Turner method. That's me, Paw Turner. You can call me that. Anyway, I like shoe boxes. They come with the lid, and they are just the right size to hide in cupboards and under other people's beds. <laughs> On the night of the P-A-R-T-Y, I'll serve him dinner out there so he can keep whittling or plotting to take over the free world, whatever he's up to. Now, only problem is, sometimes them live rats, they get a little feisty and chew right through their box. Of course, you wanna catch them and get them before the rat entrenches itself in the walls of your home and infests the place with its disease-bearing offspring. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! That's right, isn't it, Marilyn? I just can't get over my dad 
being the rat whisperer. Something is going on and I don't know what it is. What is he doing out in that shed all day long? Why does he keep Cuddles, or puppy dog, on a leash in the backyard? I believe he's up to something. Baby, do we have any cheese? I'll keep you posted. It's past midnight, but you internet hippies don't have any real jobs anyway, so I'm sure you're all wide awake. I wouldn't be up myself, except the party is only 18 hours away, and I need to make sure that none of the ammo is running around loose again. Whoops. That's one of my traps. I hope it's a newcomer and not an escapee. Over and out. I cleaned all morning, but you know, there's still this smell, this funky smell going throughout my house. And I, I can't figure out what it is. I don't have time to worry about it. I've lit lots of candles and you know, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Dad's still out in the shed working on whatever his project is. Hopefully, once the guests arrive and he sees they brought their own food and we're not in any danger of being eaten out of house and home, he'll be able to relax and enjoy the festivities. <laughs> I'm hoping. Oh. You know what? Or maybe he'll just spend all night on his hobby and never even realize what's going on. That would be okay too. Stan, help! My father has become a super villain of the National Guard. He has weaponized rats. I repeat, my father is shooting rats. I am pleased to report that the rat cannon is a bang of success. Now I think I'll give that bathing without water method a try. Uh, you will not. And, and why are you talking to my camera? My followers do not care about your uh, rat cannon. Is this yours? We darn things all look the same. Well, I hope you're satisfied. Yeah. Everyone is leaving. I'm glad to hear it. Well, half of them are calling the CDC, and the other half are threatening to call the ASPCA. No rats were harmed in the making of this video. Stop talking to my camera. Now that the freeloaders are all gone, if you and me will go eat all that party food so it doesn't go to waste. They're taking their food with them. Their food? Everyone on the guest list brought something. We didn't provide any of it. And it's all walking out the door right now. Well, that's not fair. I was trying to be nice to you. I didn't want you to worry. I thought you'd be happy if everyone else provided the meal. But no, you had to make a rat cannon. Maybe I'll just make myself a sandwich and take it out to the shed. Well, I hope you don't want any cheese. Hi, everyone. It's me, Dee Dee. <laughs> and it's also me, Pa Turner and Veronica. I thought we agreed to get rid of all the rats. But not Veronica. Well, no one has contracted any rat-borne illnesses 
And I think we'll manage to avoid jail time. Edie made me go door to door and apologize. It was humiliating. And I don't know what you said, but our neighbors still aren't speaking to us. Never liked any of them weirdos anyway. Wait a minute, wait a minute. The guy who makes a rat cannon does not get to call other people weirdos, Dad. You folk out there, learn my lesson. Don't shoot rats at people who are bringing you free food. Oh my, it should be on a t-shirt. Well, that reminds me. Yeah, this video was sponsored by Fly By Line Media, and they sell stuff you can wear. Go buy some. There's a link in the description. No, 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 no. That's description. There's a link That's in the description. That's what I said. Oh, oh my goodness. Please take a second to like, subscribe, and- And don't forget to share this video with everyone you know who would like to build a rat cannon of their very own. Or, you know what? How about sharing it with normal people? Hurry up, Dee Dee. Veronica wants to dance. Together, we, we are Fly By Night Media, and we rise to shine.